There are a couple ways of handling a valley on a terracotta roof. One is a closed valley, the other is an open valley. And a valley is where two roof planes meet, creating a channel for water and snow melt to run off the roof. So in either case, moisture protection is a must. This is typically accomplished with a combination of adhesive membrane and metal flashing. Because of the long life of terracotta tile, 16 ounce copper is typically recommended for flashing, which is usually shaped like a W. They recommend that the flashing go over the underlayment all the way up the valley and that the edge of the flashing be covered with a strip of the adhesive membrane. The valley tiles can then be secured over that. It's important that the field tile fasteners do not penetrate the pan of the valley metal in order to keep the valley water tight. For both open and closed valleys, field tile are cut to match the exact angle of the valley. On open valleys, the tiles are held back at least three inches on each side and that allows for leaves and other debris to wash off with any rain or snow melt. They also recommend gradually increasing the exposure one inch for every eight feet, running from the ridge all the way down to the eave. On closed valleys, the cut pieces are lined up next to the diverter in the center. Moisture will get through, so a closed valley requires the same protections underneath as an open one. And a closed valley is not recommended if you have a lot of leaves falling on that part of the roof.